Hey everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to tie a knot called the double bowlin on a bite. And it's similar in ways to the Spanish bowlin in the sense that you can have these two adjustable loops here that are connected to one another. Um, but the added security of using a double strand. So you use a doubled rope. Um, here's how you tie it. So get a good long length of rope and then double it over. So you, I have about this much here. Um, and the first step is going to be to do your classic start to any bowling, which is to create this loop here. And then you can go around one time and then bring this end here down and through the loop and then use that bite to go over all of the strands and then find the strands that are connected to the loop, pull it tight And lastly, adjust all of the strands so that they take, they, you know, they evenly distribute the weight. And this is the end result. You can see that classic bowling look. And once again, you can use these loops in any number of ways. Um, but a good way to use it is if you need to attach two different objects. Um, they don't even have to be of the same size. You can have one that's of a much larger diameter than the other. And this will allow you to very securely um, connect this line to the objects. And now you can, at the other end here, you can connect using both strands or you can connect using the one that is forming the loop. You don't necessarily need to connect both, but you can. It's definitely more secure if you connect both strands to an anchor um, versus just the one. All right, so this has been the double bowling on a bite. Uses a double rope. Thanks so much for watching. Please consider hitting like or subscribing. Just talk to you later.